Hey guys, I had this question on my channel the other day. Somebody was talking about UV lights and whether or not it cleans the air. We're going to just basically talk about UV lights in this video. I'm not going to talk about the air cleaners and some of the products out there that involve UV lights inside the product, but maybe they have some sort of cells that the air has to pass through or some other products such as ozone or an ionizer. But we're going to talk about in this video just the UV lamps themselves. They're pretty inexpensive compared to some of those other products and a lot of folks like you the homeowner can purchase products online in fact I'll put a link down below to some of them that if you want to purchase one yourself and install them I would just caution you against doing anything that you are not comfortable doing if it involves connecting to the electrical requirements and you're not an electrician or a heating and air guy you probably shouldn't be doing that but there are heating and air UV cleaners or UV lights out there that you could just plug right into a socket if you have an outlet near your unit that said the conversation conversation I was having with someone the other day is basically UV lamps themselves do not clean the air as they pass through the evaporator coil depending on where you have that light installed and so they were making the comment that yeah air passes through there too quickly and a lot of people are lying to their consumers and saying you know, it cleans the air when it really doesn't and so on and that is true that they have proven that it doesn't actually clean the air as it goes through but what I would argue against that if you do install UV light in your air handler or furnace that it will enhance inhibit things like mold and microbes and all kinds of other harmful things that can grow on your evaporator coil or in your evaporator coil drain pan. And again, depending on where you mount that light, you can inhibit those things. Yes, you're not cleaning the air, but if that UV light weren't there and air was passing through there and picking up some of those harmful things and blowing back into your home, obviously that's not good either. I would dare argue that a UV lamp inside of a indoor unit, whether it be an air handler or furnace, is in my opinion, one of the basic minimums. I think there are all kinds of great products out there that can clean the air, filters, ionizers, again, all kinds of things that you can do that are great, but I would say bare minimum, if you're not gonna do anything, it's my belief that you should have a UV light shining on that evaporator coil, doing your best to keep that thing as clean as possible. Evaporator coils do sweat, they do condensate, they do have water that sits stagnant at times, and of course the drain pan is a concern as well. And then lastly, air does flow through there, and if you're not doing something to inhibit it from producing harmful things in your home, then I would say that you are asking for trouble there. If you do have a breathing issue, I think it's a no-brainer, but even if you don't, who wants to develop one? My old boss used to always say that if you don't have a good filter in your home or an air cleaner, guess who is filtering that air? You. You're the one breathing in that harmful air and filtering it. I hope that helps. Again, UV lights don't necessarily clean the air. It does clean the items that your air is passing through that could be adding harmful things things in your home. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.